Meghan and Harry under pressure to succeed in America with their children. In 2020, Meghan, Duchess of Sussex and Prince Harry stepped down as senior royals. Their plan was to pursue their own work outside of the royal family as well as achieve financial independence. Now that the Sussexes are living in California and free to create their own path, a royal expert believes they are under tremendous pressure to succeed. After stepping down, Meghan and Harry went on to sign production deals with streaming platforms, such as Netflix and Spotify. They also have a book deal with Penguin Random House. So far, the couple has only released one podcast episode for Spotify. Meghan also released a children's book called The Bench in June 2021. Meghan and Harry are still working on content for Netflix. Meghan is producing a children's show about historical women, called Pearl. Meanwhile, Harry is working on a doku series about the Invictus Games. Harry is also writing a memoir, which will be published in 2022. Because the Sussexes fought to leave the royal family and go their own way. Royal expert Duncan Larkholm believes they cannot afford to fail in their new career path. With these deals, there's tremendous pressure on Harry and Meghan to deliver. And make a success of their life in America, Larkholm said, according to Closer Online. He added, they've caused such an uproar for both the royal family and in the media that they don't really have the option of failing. It would be the ultimate humiliation. If Netflix aren't happy, and the production doesn't get the audiences that they are expecting, they won't give them another contract. Larkholm also noted that Meghan and Harry are now competing in the commercial world, which is cutthroat. After Meghan and Harry stepped down, the couple started speaking to the press about grievances they have against the royal family. This reportedly caused them to be estranged from Harry's relatives. According to Larkham, although the couple has found freedom in California, they are also trapped in a way. If freedom is being able to say what you want, when you want, to whoever you choose to speak to, then Harry has found a degree of freedom, Larkham explained. But if freedom is having goodwill behind you to live in peace, being able to live life as you want it or being at peace with the people you vote with, then freedom has not been achieved. Larkham added, it's backfired. Harry and Meghan seem to have totally isolated themselves they are more trapped than ever in this new life they've created. Larkham believes Harry will not feel free and at peace until he can make amends with loved ones. Meghan, Duchess of Sussex and Prince Harry tied the knot in 2018 in front of millions of adoring fans. Although the couple often seems to be in love, a royal expert says things could be different behind the scenes. Meghan and Harry reportedly could have an uphill battle to maintain their relationship given their damaged backgrounds. Meghan and Harry grew up in different countries and different socio-economic statuses, but their childhood has had some similarities. The most striking common denominator is the fact that Meghan and Harry both have divorced parents. Meghan's parents, Thomas Markell Sr. and Doria Ragland, divorced when she was in elementary school. Growing up, Meghan split her time between her parents' homes. Although her parents were cordial to one another. According to Lady Colin Campbell in her book Meghan and Harry, The Real Story, Meghan spent a lot of time dealing with their differences and relaying communications between them. Meanwhile, Harry's parents, Prince Charles and Princess Diana, famously divorced in the 1990s when Harry was not yet a teenager. Unlike Meghan, Harry had to deal with the media circus surrounding his parents' affairs. And his mother's tell-all interviews. Then, in 1997, his mother died in a car accident. According to royal expert Angela Levin, Meghan and Harry's childhood experiences with divorced parents could mean negativity for their marriage. This is in contrast to Prince William, whose wife, Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge, came from a more stable family. Children of broken homes, especially if the parental breakup was unpleasant, often don't know how a good relationship works, Levin said, according. William learnt through the Middletons how a loving and supportive family works. It has been the bedrock of making Kate loving, calm and confident. Levin added, Harry hasn't had that parental opportunity. His background has just been a bit of fighting and incompatibility. Both he and Meghan come from very damaged backgrounds and must carry with them some of the negativity. It must be hard for them to help each other and lack experience in how stable, strong, understanding relationships work. Meghan and Harry often keep their family life private. 
so royal followers can only make speculations about what goes on behind closed doors. In any case, the couple seems to be doing things differently for the next generation. In 2020, Meghan and Harry stepped down as senior royals and moved to California. They now live in Montecito and are doing work in the entertainment industry. The couple signed deals with Netflix and Spotify to produce content for the platforms. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.